Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems that we may be facing a major privacy flaw with the Microsoft Edge web browser and in the Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop. And this is according to uh, recent reports um, that are doing the rounds online um, where apparently um, Edge is sending most visited web pages to Bing, Microsoft Bing automatically now. And this was spotted, give or take, over the last week or so ago. And uh, um, where one of the later versions of Edge version 112, which is the latest release, uh, is sending out requests to the Bing API website, which does feature URLs of sites that you've visited, which when it comes to privacy is not a good thing. And also this um, does occur from time to time, but obviously is now regarding this flaw happening more than it should be and more than usual. Now, um, apparently this started with a recent update to the Edge web browser. So if we just head over to about Microsoft Edge, uh, it started with Edge version 112.0.1722.34. Now currently we are on point release 58. So this did start um, as mentioned over the last week or so. So if you have the latest release of Microsoft Edge, and which you should have if you do use the browser on a regular basis because it will automatically update in the background. Um, you could be faced with this privacy flaw. Now, um, the issue is apparently being caused by a feature which rolled out to Edge about a year ago called Follow Creators, which is basically an RSS feed, and I have posted on this feature previously. So if you want more, more in-depth info regarding Follow Creators, just do a search on the channel Edge Follow Creators, and I'm sure you'll get more than enough info. But just to do a quick recap, um, Follow Creators is turned on by default in the browser. And uh, um, what happens is that, um, just to show you quickly, if we head to the collections and we go to following, I am already following a YouTube channel, Hardware Unboxed, the good folks over at Hardware Unboxed, with this um, Follow Creators feature. And what happens, um, as mentioned, it's basically an RSS reader in Edge. So when enabled, um, when you get head to a website, as an example, like um, a YouTube channel, and what you'll see uh, in the address bar um, is it displays an option uh, in the address bar um, on supported sites. And if you click on that option, it gives you the option to follow the creator. And this was, first of all, limited to YouTube. And now since um, uh, the feature did roll out um, a year or so ago, um, Microsoft now has expanded the follow creators to other websites. And this is where the problem comes in now. So whenever a website is visited and this feature is enabled, Microsoft Edge now is submitting the full URL of the page you are visiting to the Bing APIs domain as mentioned, which is not a good thing. Now, um, at this stage, um, Microsoft say they are investigating this issue, but if you want a simple resolution and workaround until Microsoft does roll out a fix or does address this issue, then it's actually quite simple to rectify. And we can actually turn the follow creators feature off in Microsoft Edge. And to do this, um, we just head back to the menu. This time we click on settings and we head to privacy search and services. And on the privacy search and services page, you scroll down to the bottom until you see services. And yeah, you'll see uh, uh, two settings. And the first is show suggestions to follow creators in Microsoft Edge, which the description reads, we'll suggest content creators you can follow in Microsoft Edge based on creator's profile. Turn that off. And then the next one you want to turn off, which will be turned off automatically, but nonetheless is get notified when creators you follow post new content where um, they'll show you notifications when those uh, posts um, are um, obviously rolled out. And you just toggle both of those off um, show suggestions to follow creators in Microsoft Edge and get notified when creators you follow post new content and apparently that should to some degree lessen the so-called phone in home and sending um, your websites and URLs to uh, the Bing website until Microsoft addresses this issue and does roll out a fix and I'll watch this one and obviously if something does change or there is an update I will post and let you know. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.